on YouTube coming at you with my second uh, Kanto Cup team. And this one is ABB style, double week two fighting in the back. I decided to like, let's just use the bulkiest Pokemon I have uh, built up because bulk is better. So Shadow Snorlax and I had Dugong. So I'm like, okay, both of those are weak to fighting. So I need something that can deal with the fighter in the front. Uh, and that was Mew. I, I faced Mew yesterday and it's tricky on the lead because just like Shadow Claws are amazing moves, Surf and Wild Charge coverage charges pretty quickly. So let's get into the battles here. I did not as amazing as I did with the team before. Just because, well, I'm only going to show a couple matches. I wonder if this is one of the ones that had the mirror match. So build up. Nope, this is just Beedrill, so that's fine. Bank it and come in here with the Snorlax. And the shadow, I think the shadow makes it better and worse. Like, because now the all these moves are going to add up way too quick. I mean, you're 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 forcing more shield pressure here, which is good, but you still now if they get to another move, no matter what it is, because I'm a shadow, I have to shield this if I want to keep switch. So I do shield it because I'm loaded with energy and I don't really want to come do gong into that because they could have like dynamic punch and I can't really throw anything, so I have to keep switch. They unload their energy, which is fine for fine by me. Uh, the only problem is they're gonna have I'm gonna have to throw three moves here, right? This helps if I hit some bubbles here. Get the first wild charge off. They let it go. So that almost one shots. And it's a dugong in the back. So I just go. I, I could just. I could have baited here. There's no need to need to throw this. I could have baited with a surf. They're definitely going to shield. Because they're not going to let. They have two shields in the back. And they don't know what I have yet. So they're going to shield no matter what. Catch on my dugong. And this is why I will never play with this team again. <laughs> I wanted to showcase it. Was this mirror match right here. Where you only have resistant moves, you're both super bulky, and you're both lowering each other's attack. And so what do you want to talk about? What's going on? How's the weather? It snowed here on this day that I'm filming, even though it's the end of April. Why? I don't know. It sucks. Almost like this mirror match sucks. So we're eventually going to throw 100 icy winds at each other. <laughs> this, mirror, this mirror match is so bad. I may actually just like, should have fast forwarded even more. There's nothing that you can really do here. I also had it in another match. I I don't know if I put that one in too. Where it's just like, I, yeah, I got a head on energy. They used shield. They eventually came in here. I was like, I don't want to waste my time. So they came in and reset. But now that's good because now I can just like icy win a couple times back to back wild charges for the win here. So the mirror match sucks. Uh, so yeah, if you want to use Dugong, hope. Your opponent doesn't have dugong or you don't get matched up with them <laughs> like because it's it's slow going it is slow going uh, so eventually yeah eventually i'm gonna come in and just wild charge double wild charge for the win uh let me know if you guys have any pokemon you want me to try i don't know how many i'm gonna do because i like i said i want to showcase the viewer submitted battle for the Kanto cup and it is a sand slash lick a tongue and i forget the third pokemon so i'll do that on saturday i, I do go back back wild charge here before the timer runs out and then sunday i missed maybe do like one or two shorts and then leads into monday tuesday a couple more canto cups or master league teams i just went through actually i before this i went through all my submissions and there's no submissions for master league right now in the link that is submitted to there's a lot of ultra league there's a couple old ones like Retro Cup, Halloween Cup. I'll keep those around just in case they come back. There's a bunch of great league that I have to look at again too. But for the most part, there's like just Ultra League. And I'm using the one cancel that was submitted. So uh, if you want me to showcase yours, just let me know. Because I only, like I said, I only going to have like Monday or Tuesday to go to. And then it was Flying Cup. So I'll go over teams and rankings for Flying Cup on Wednesday. And then what day is my Tho battle? I forget if I'm battling Thursday or Wednesday or Thursday next week against though to that video. So you guys have been, because I'm, I'm filming this right after my Purple Kyogre one went, went live. And it seems like you guys are getting into this a lot more because my one with R2 didn't have a lot, which is okay. He's a, like a super small YouTuber. But then my Dax one, I expected a lot more, but it was it was decent. But my, now my Purple Kyogre one is like blowing the, blowing the Dax battle out of the water. So you guys are getting into these battles. I got thrown though next week. Um, so I'm hoping I can win, or if I lose, I'm hoping that I can get, I think I need a few wins. By the time this goes up, yeah, by the time this goes up, 
all the battles will be done for this week, which means that you guys will know the scores after this week. So I can tell you the scores now because all the videos will be posted. So in my, in my, okay, wait, one sec. Okay, so I am posting Wednesday again next week. So it's going to be one of those flying cup teams in the morning. And then a couple hours later, my battle against Stowe. So looking at, I'll just do my bracket because the other bracket's actually a little ahead for next week already. So my bracket right now, though, has won all of his matches and has 11 wins. So he's automatically into the semis. Whether he gets first or second will depend on whether I can like sweep him or not. So it's not going to happen. Realistically, we're all fighting for second in our group, which is kind of what it was expected. Uh, I'm, pay I'm facing Tho, and then Purple Kyogre is facing Dax. So I have two wins, one loss. And Purple Kyogre and Dax both have one win. So like I said, if I win, I'm in. If I lose and one of the others, like one of the others have to win, right? It will then come down to battles won. Right now, I have a couple game lead over Purple Kyogre. So even though he beat me in the heads up because he lost to R2-1-4 um, and all my, I've won one more battle and I've got so if he wins, let's say he wins 3-2. If I lose 3-2 against Tho, I theoretically could still finish in the second spot. So my goal is to, I mean, my goal is to win against Tho. But it, realistically, if I don't win, I got to try and grab a couple wins out of the set of five to try and make the semis. Yonkis has been rolling through people and the other one. So he's going to be first. Um... And I think, I think the second one is already set as well. I think it's gonna be Yonkis first and Swag second, unless Daniel Z sweeps Swag next week. Do you guys see this? Sorry, I know you guys probably weren't paying attention because I was going over this stuff. This happened to me today. Look at this. So I am loaded on it. And this, I talked about this the other game, but the game being absolutely broken. I have two and a quarter body slams. Out comes the Nid Queen. This is easy. I, so I press body slam. I press body slam. I press body slam. I press body slam. Spin, 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 spin. They're getting five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm almost done. I should have been at half health and got both moves off. And now I'm in like one HP from being taken out. Finally, the game lets me throw those two moves i get the body slam off back to back they have a hypno in the back and i'm still ahead one shield so i will win this but god damn fix your game niantic please this is so frustrating and i don't even care about the gbl aspect i'm actually having more way more fun doing this like uh the content creator tournament i'm having more fun in the like the pick six self tournament pick three self tournaments so I don't really care about GBL right now in the in the down season, but man, it is frustrating. So Raichu, so this will be so this uh, content creator tournament that I put together has been nice to do like get like five weeks worth of uh, videos, and hopefully I can get like one more, hopefully two more after like the though, but we'll see. Uh, what do you guys want to see next? I, I I mentioned yesterday there's only five weeks left, and by the time this is posted, there'll be like four and a half weeks left in this season. So do you want me to just roll through just these like weekly videos? I know people liked the one-off videos I'm doing about like um what's it called the PV poke analysis. People enjoyed that. Uh, people enjoy these videos in the tournament. So I'm trying to think like what else can I do? to get you guys to watch these videos because i'm going to be honest like i used to watch i try to watch and support all the pvp content creators who are putting out videos themselves but then this season i'm not clicking on any of them and it's just kind of like it's one of those things where it's like I've, one i've seen it all before <laughs> quite honestly because there's like nothing new this season like i said this Canto Cup, I've already got 14, 15 videos on Canto Cup. So now we're going through another 
five or six added to this. So I'm not clicking on their videos, which means I can see my click through rate and my like rate and my uh, viewer rate that's down across the board. So is there something that you want to see over these next four weeks that you would pre like prefer I make a video on that would keep you interested? Like I said, I think going through the overrated, underrated Ultra League Pokemon, I think that'll be good because people seem to enjoy that. Oh, I forgot to fast for this. No, 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 no. We are not doing that. Okay. No way am I looking at half speed here. Okay, here we go. Sorry about that. So Snorlax lead. And so these Dugong Snorlax are pretty solid safe swaps here. Like they're they're doing Hypno. Hypno's a good solid safe swap. Snorlax, Dugong. There's a lot in play that you can use a safe swap just because like you know you're not gonna run into like you're not gonna run into dark stuff your hypno. You're, there's not there's some counter users, but there's like not a ton of counter users, quite honestly. Right? Who who is the counter users here? There's Machamp. You could use counter Alakazam. I ran into that the other day. Um I guess my choke if you have it. But I don't think there's like a oh primeape. Primeape. But there's like no surfetch, there's no metacham. So some of the other counter users that you would normally see. So I got a two shield advantage. I'm gonna have to throw one here. I assume they're not gonna shield a Snorlax. So I'll get that wild charge off, come with my own. They instantly swap two. So now it is. Nidoqueen Queen against Snorlax. I can take one move, so I know they're gonna just throw that and lower my defense. So I gotta save it for the second one. Hopefully, I can get back to back off and take this out, and then hopefully, I can have wild charge for the win on the Snorlax. So I got one shield. I have two shields. I'll use one to get this body slam off. So this should take it pretty low. I don't know if it takes it out, but the licks do damage here. One of the problems with this team and why I wouldn't run this team outside of the Dugong Mirror match is Shadow Claw and Lek are both ghosts. Oh, they don't even let me boom them. Shadow Claw and Lek are both ghosts. So if you run into like a normal like Lickitung or something, you are in a bit of trouble. And I or Pidgeot and stuff like that. I had I did that once in this set. I ran into like a I forget what it was. I think it was a I think it was a Lickitung. And I was like, oh, I don't have anything for this. So I think I came in dugong right away but those are the battles um like i said let me know if what you want me to showcase uh and thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one